Hello listeners, Eileen here once again and I'm presenting another of my profiles. This time it is going to be a double. By that I mean Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy. I've had several requests to do this and you all know who you are. Hope you enjoy. So here goes. In this world you are all that I adore. Wanting you, every day I am wanting you, every night I am longing to hold you close to my eager That heaven seems far above any hope that I'll gain my quest. This couple had a really successful partnership, both having talents in various directions. Jeanette Anna MacDonald was born on 18th of June 1903 in Philadelphia. She was the youngest of the three daughters born to Daniel and Anne MacDonald. Let's now hear We Will Always Be Sweethearts. This is sung by Jeanette and was recorded in 1932. Agree. 
that each time is more thrilling. And so I can say we will always be sweethearts the same as the day we began. Nelson Eddy was born June 29, 1901, in Providence, Rhode Island, the son of William Darius and Isabel Eddy. He sang as a boy soprano in a few church choirs. He was to move later to Philadelphia with his mother when his parents separated, and this was in 1915. Let's have some music now. Nelson singing, Lover Come Back to Me.
sky is blue, the night is cold, the moon is new, but love is old, and while I'm waiting here, this heart of mine is I will go back to Jeanette MacDonald now. As a child, she made her debut singing and dancing in the local Kiddie Review. This was hard going, and she later followed her sister Blossom to New York. Jeanette MacDonald will now sing Always in All Ways. We all must have our dreary day. As well as bright and cheery days But sun or shadow you can count on me Though lady luck may frown on you And gloomy clouds look down on you Remember I will still be by your side Forever Always in all ways rely upon me should any doubt come wait for the outcome hopefully always in all ways whatever may be I will rely on you and trust you sometimes in small ways not agree, but we will weather hardship together, wait and see, we'll have a happy ending, if you will keep depending, always in all ways. Oh. As I've already said, Blossom was in New York, appearing in the chorus in Ned Wayburn's review. Jeanette landed a part dancing. She still continued with her studies. When Wayburn staged the dances for Jerome Kern's The Night Boat, he made up his mind to use Jeanette in the chorus. So she made her Broadway debut at the Liberty Theatre on February the 2nd, 1920. A lovely redhead with a beautiful smile. Here she is singing Sweetheart Waltz. This was from the MGM film Sweethearts. Oh, 
back to Nelson Eddy. As a very young man, he was a switchboard operator and a shipping clerk in the local ironworks. He later obtained work as a night clerk with the Philadelphia Press, where he was taught to write obituaries. I now play a track of Nelson Eddy singing At the Balalaika. Let me linger there till break of day 
the young and bell alike us play. I have a wrong Nelson Eddy had quite a career in the newspaper world. He made his theatrical debut in 1922. It was a musical called The Marriage Tax. He wasn't even listed in the cast. From there he appeared in Ireland,ly Gilbert and Sullivan. Let's hear Nelson Eddy and Jeanette MacDonald singing now. How about Indian Love Call? This was, of course, from Rosemary. Indian Love Call from Rosemary. In late 1920, Jeanette MacDonald landed a role in Irene. This was one of the longest running shows of the time. There followed several years of Broadway popularity for Jeanette. The Magic Ring, Yes Yes Yvette, Boom Boom and Sunny Days and Angela. Let's hear another song from Jeanette MacDonald now. Here is Vilia. Oh, 
That was Jeanette MacDonald singing Vilia, recorded in 1934. It was whilst appearing in Angela, Jeanette MacDonald was spotted by Richard Dix, a very popular actor of the time. He liked the idea of her being his leading lady. The screen test she took was filed away, and it wasn't until a year later, Paramount director Ernest Lubitsch was searching for a young singer to appear opposite Maurice Chevalier. This film was The Love Parade and was to become one of the great hits of 1922. Jeanette made a great impression singing Dream Lover.
reminder now, dear listeners, that you're listening to Angel Radio on 101.1 FM. And if you are on the internet, angelradio.co.uk. And I'm Eileen, presenting a profile on Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy. Nelson Eddy won a competition to join the Philadelphia Civic Opera. His first role being in Aida. This was when his operatic training really began. He worked all through the 20s in opera. He was also skilled in singing in many languages. A Nelson Eddy record now. Here is Panis Angelicus. Nelson decided to give up opera and concentrated on concert work. His name and voice were increasingly familiar to millions of Americans through his radio and concert performances. Let's now hear Smiling Through. Oh, 
white cock by the sea. There's a little green gate at whose trellis I wait while to eyes of blue comes smiling In 1933, Nelson Eddy was spotted by MGM and assigned to appear in several films, including Dancing Lady, Student Tour and Broadway to Hollywood. In 1935, he was cast as a leading man to Jeanette MacDonald in Naughty Marietta. I think possibly the rest is history. I will now play Tramp, Tramp, Tramp from Naughty Marietta. Now clear the roadway 
Virginians and Canucks, Virginians and Kentucks, Captain Dick, home infantry. Captain Dick, home infantry. Jeanette MacDonald starred in several films, The Cat and the Fiddle in 1934, also that year, The Merry Widow. She co-starred with Raymond Navarro and Mara Chevalier in that film. She then agreed to star in the movie version of a 25-year-old operetta, Naughty Marietta. The partnership with Nelson Eddy was born. Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy will now sing Will You Remember? Recorded in 1936. Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy were to star in seven more films over a six-year period. Incidentally, that last track, Will You Remember, was from the film Maytime. I think I shall play Song of Love, and this is from the musical Blossom Time. kingdom by the sea lived a young prince sad and lonely and an enchantment of magic mystery who be set free by 
my one only. Weary he waited while years sped along. Came then a maid to his home. Love broke the spell, so the story books tell. back to Jeanette MacDonald now and she is going to sing I'll See You Again and this is from the MGM motion picture Bittersweet and this was 1947. I wonder how many of you remember these films and musical shows etc. To begin with if you please sing a scale for me Take a breath and then reprise in a different key. Learning scales will never seem so sweet again till our destiny shall let us meet again. The will of fate may come too late when I'm recalling the hours we've had. Why will the foolish tears tremble across the years? Why shall I feel so sad, treasuring the memory of these days always? I'll see you again whenever spring has been is past forgetting this sweet memory across the years will come to me though my world be gone Just the echoes 
I do hope you're enjoying this profile, dear listeners. I had several requests to do this one. If there is anyone special you would like me to profile, please let me know here at Angel Radio. Either ring in or put a note in the post to 17 Market Parade, haven't, to me, Eileen. Nelson Eddy married Anne Franklin in 1939. He was married to her until his death in 1967. He had a stroke whilst on stage. I'm going to play now Nelson Eddy singing Danny Boy. The pipes are calling from glen to glen and down the mountain side. The summer's gone and all the roses falling. It's you, it's you must go and I must buy. But come ye back. Summer's in the meadow Oh, when the valley's hushed and white with snow It's I'll be here in sunshine or in shadow Oh, Danny boy, oh, Danny Flowers are dying, and I am dead, as dead I well may be. You'll come and find the place where I am lying, and kneel and say, Tread above me, and all my grave will warm a sweeter be. For you will bend and tell me that you. Jeanette MacDonald was considered for the role of the Mother Abbess in The Sound of Music, but due to ill health, this didn't happen. She has two stars in the Hollywood Walk of Fame and Grauman's Chinese Theatre. She has recorded more than 90 songs, three gold records, one with Nelson Eddy, quite a few romances, but married Jean Raymond in 1937 and was with him until her death in 1965. She is interred in Forest Lawn, California. Here is Jeanette singing The Merry Widow Waltz. Oh 
Jeanette singing The Merry Widow Waltz. There was always speculation about the relationship between Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy. I think he wanted her to be with him, but she wouldn't hear of it. Jeanette had heart problems, also a non-operable brain tumour. Jeanette and Nelson really worked well together in their professional life. It was said that what Fred Astaire did for dance, Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy did for operetta. I'm going to play now with these hands. Now I know this is a profile on Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy, but this next track is Nelson Eddy, and he is singing with the lovely Joe Stafford. I was unable to resist this one as I love Joe Stafford. <laughs> With these hands, Nelson Eddy and Joe Stafford.
Did you know that there is a website which sells all Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy memorabilia? Such things as mugs, scarves, hats, etc., all with their logo on. I'm going to play now Farewell to Dreams. At the end of my profile on Nelson Eddy and Jeanette MacDonald, I do hope you've enjoyed this program, dear listeners. Thank you for listening. Also, my thanks must go to dear Martin, who does all the engineering for me. As I have said many times, he is a real gem. I'm going to finish with Jeanette MacDonald and Nelson Eddy singing Our Sweet Mystery of Life. This is Eileen saying bye for now and God bless. Last I found thee, but last I know the secret of it all. All the longing, seeking, striving, waiting, yearning, the idle hopes, the joy and burning tears that pour.